<laughs> Go Buster! Buster and his friends are on a holiday at the beach. What a fun day out! Wow, the sea looks amazing! What is that in the water? Ah, it's a shark! Buster is very scared! Oops, watch out, Iggy! <laughs> Mommy Bus is taking a nap on the beach. Buster is trying to tell her what he saw. It had scary fins and jumped out of the water. It was a shark! <gasps> hmm. hmm, Mommy Bus can't see anything. <gasps> Don't worry, Buster. Everything is fine, and Mommy Bus is going back to her nap. Buster is still very scared. I wonder if the shark is still there. Ah, it's a shark! Go, Buster, go! Oops, not again. Buster is still frightened, but he wants to get over his fear. He's going back again. There's the shark. Wait a second, what's wrong? The shark has a sore, wobbly tooth. That's why it was jumping out of the water. Don't worry, shark. Buster can help. He's trying to get mommy's attention. She's awake. She's got her red kit and mommy bus to the rescue. Splat! Yum, yum. Mommy Bus is removing the shark's wobbly tooth. It's out! Hooray! The shark feels so much better now. Well done, Buster! He can't wait to show the tooth to his friends. His friends are at school. And today, they have a very special visitor. It's Mommy Fire Truck! Hooray! She's here to show them what a fire truck does. When a building is on fire, you have to call a firefighter as quick as you can. What happens next? A hose is attached to a water hydrant and the water puts out the fire. Yippee! It's time to practice. They have to knock the cones over with a jet of water. Ash is first. Yay! Well done, Ash! And Scout? Oop! That's better. Well done! Now it's Buster's turn. Wow! Watch out, Buster! That was a great day, but now Mommy Fire Truck needs to get to work. <laughs> Goodbye, Mommy Fire Truck. Thank you. Now it's the end of the day, and Buster is heading home. Bye, Scout. Bye, Ash. <gasps> what is that? It's smoke. Where could it be coming from? Oh, no. It's a fire. What should Buster do? He needs a firefighter. Buster is getting Mommy Fire Truck to help. Teacher will take care of Ash. Go, Mommy, go! There's the fire. Aha! And there's a water hydrant. Next step, attach the hose. Oh no, quick! Phew, the fire is out. Yippee! What great teamwork. It's the next day at school. 
Teacher is calling Buster up to the front. What could it be for? Look! Mommy fire truck! She's here to thank Buster for all his help and award him with a special fire truck hat. Go, Buster! Daddy Bus is taking Buster, Bandit, and Scout on a camping trip in the woods. It's time to set up the campsite. First, they've got to put up their tents. Yay! Daddy is showing them how. He's hammering in the pegs to stop the tent from blowing away. Look, they are keeping the tent in place. Aha! All done! Whilst Daddy Bus collects wood for the fire, Buster and his friends are finishing their tents. <gasps> what was that? <laughs> Bandit has some marshmallows. <gasps> Yummy! <gasps> oh no! Buster didn't hammer the pegs in properly. The tent has come loose. He can't see a thing. Watch out, Scout! Uh-oh, it's blowing away. Will Buster be able to catch it? Scout and Bandit join in to help. Go, Buster, you can do it. Aha, it's finally fallen to the ground. Oh dear, not again! Daddy Bus, look out! Oops! The firewood has gone flying! Phew, he's okay! Time to finally put the tent up! Let's make sure all the pegs are in this time, Buster! Great job! I wonder what Daddy Bus has planned next. Wow! They're roasting marshmallows. Mmm, delicious! What a brilliant day! Buster and Scout are on their way home from school. Bye, Scout! What's Buster spotted? Oh, look! It's Diggly and Daisy! Buster wants to help. But safety first! Look at that awesome builder's hat! Buster is helping them move a crate off Rocky the Riverboat. Great teamwork, guys! Now they're placing the crate on the construction site. Mr. Rubble is off to get some lunch. See you later, Mr. Rubble! Oh, no! The crate is sinking into the mud! Go, Buster, go! Oh no! Now Buster is stuck in the mud as well! Daisy to the rescue! Nope! That didn't work! What's that? Diggly is hooked up to that crane! And he's pulling Buster out! It's working! Just a little bit more. Oops. Now they're all stuck. And Mr. Rubble hasn't noticed. But Buster's got a plan. He's wrapping the wire around the crane and attaching it to the crate so they can pull themselves out. Brilliant idea, Buster! Diggly and Daisy are both pulling the rope at different times. But they need to work together. And that's it! Hooray! It worked! Mr. Rubble still hasn't noticed them. So they quickly pull the crate out. Everything is back to normal. Well, not quite back to normal. They're all covered in mud. It's time to get cleaned up. Mr. Rubble is spraying them with the hose. There, that's much better. Now it's time for a spot of lunch. Yum, yum. 
But what's that? Mr. Rubble has driven straight into the mud! <laughs> Don't worry, Mr. Rubble. They know just what Look. to do. It's Buster the bus. But whoa, he sure looks sleepy. He's driving off the road. Oh no! Buster's ended up in the muddy puddle. And now he's stuck. Poor Buster. How will he get out? The next morning, Scout visits Buster's garage. But, oh dear, Buster is nowhere to be found. Where is he? But look, muddy tracks. Scout is following them to see where Buster is. There's Diggly the Digger. Scout tells him Buster's missing. They need to find him. Scout and Diggly search together. Look, a trail of sweets. Where could it lead? Whoa, what was that? Aw, phew, it's just Robin. Scout explains that Buster is missing, and Robin agrees to help search too. They'll have a better chance of finding him if they work together. Poor Buster is lonely and cold. Scout looks behind the trees. Diggly looks beside the rocks. What's Robin seen? Some more tire tracks. Look, there's Buster. He's stuck in the mud. He's been here so long. Robin goes to tell Diggly and Scout that he's found Whoa. Buster. He's just over the hill. There's poor Buster. <laughs> Diggly and Scout can help. Working together, Diggly and Scout pull Buster out of the muddy puddle. Huh? Now Buster is free at last. He's very grateful to his friends for rescuing him. Now he's back, safe and sound in his garage. <laughs> There, all squeaky clean. Nice work, champ. We've got to look our best for Great Uncle Busby's lunch. He hates mess. Trust me. Oh? Hmm. Oh. <laughs> now let's get going, or we'll be late. And Buster? <laughs> uh, yeah? Stay away from those muddy puddles. Hmm. We need to use the car wash again. <laughs> I'm clean. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> uh -huh. I'm so excited to see Great Uncle Busby. He always has such tasty lunches. Chips and sandwiches and cheese sticks. Mmm. That's right, Buster. And carrot cake and steam buns and lemonade. Do you think he'll have blueberry muffins again? Do you, Daddy? Do you? I hope so. And peanut butter and ice cream and... Oh. Huh? Oh. Sorry! Hmm. Car wash again? <laughs> Hurry up! We're gonna be late! <laughs> come on, Daddy! I'll race you! Oh, yeah? Here I come! <laughs> Kate! <gasps> Whoa! Oh, <gasps> oh steaming gaskets! Any moment. <laughs> we made it just in time. Well done, Buster. Thanks, Daddy. 
Okay. Let's go see Uncle Busby. <laughs> Sorry! Oh. Huh? <laughs> Daddy, hmm? I think he needs to use the car wash. Hmm. <laughs> Buster, Bandit, and Mira are outside playing with their soccer ball. <laughs> Daddy Bus is fishing. <sighs> he hasn't caught any fish yet. Buster has some great skills. Whoa, and so does Mira. That's a big kick, Bandit. Watch out, Mira. Oh no, the ball knocked Mira's hat off. Where did it go? It's not over here. It's definitely not over there. Mira is upset that her favorite hat is missing. Don't worry, Mira. We'll help you find it. Buster has an idea. We can look for the hat using our imagination. Now we can turn the search into a fun game. Off they go. It's time to look for that hat. Whoa, those are very big footprints. They decide to follow them and see where they go. Stop. What's that up ahead? <gasps> it's a dinosaur! And he's wearing Mira's hat! Uh-oh! Run! They're going as fast as they can, but the dinosaur isn't far behind. And Buster spots a big volcano up ahead. They've got to get over that puddle. Buster and Mira make it, but oh no! Bandit gets stuck! Buster is trying to help Bandit get out. <gasps> Uh-oh! The dinosaur caught up with them! He looks very scary! But what's the dinosaur doing? He's seen his reflection! And I think he likes the hat. But that's Mira's hat, and she wants it back. Looks like she has an idea. <laughs> wow! Nice shot, Mira! The ball knocked the hat right off! Oh no! But looks like the hat is flying straight towards the volcano! How are they going to get it back now? Buster can do it using his imagination! It's Super Buster! Off he flies to save the hat! It's getting closer and closer to the volcano! He needs to be quick! Go, Buster! He got it! Buster, you're a great friend. <laughs> they played a fun game, and Mira got her favorite hat back. <laughs> Everything is more fun when you use your imagination. Hey everyone, what a lovely sunset. I bet Buster has had so much fun in the sun. I wonder what that green slime is. Oh no, it's dropped on Buster, and I don't think he's noticed. What's happening? Something isn't right. Look at all the gravestones and pumpkins appearing. This is spooky. And what's happened to Buster? I think that green slime has changed Buster into a zombie. That's one big pumpkin digger is carving, and it looks great. Who's that? Oh no, it's Zombie Buster. Digger is really frightened. But I don't think Buster knows what he looks like. Oh, look, it's Scout. Buster is so happy to see her. Oh, no. She seems scared, too. Oh, no. Scout is hiding from Buster, just like Digger did. Poor Buster is so upset and lonely. Come on, Scout. Buster is your friend. I think Scout has an idea. She wants Buster to follow her. Do you see now, Buster? You look like a zombie. That's why everyone is scared of you. Don't worry, Buster. Look, the slime has come off on Scout's wheel. I think Scout has a plan. A car wash? Good idea, Scout. Buster always loves a car wash. 
Yay, the green has gone. Buster is no longer a zombie. That was super spooky, Buster. Oh my, Scout, you sound like a werewolf. <laughs> Happy Halloween, everyone. Buster is having so much fun playing on his drum kit. Oops, there goes a drumstick. It's rolling over to Mommy. Hmm, what's Mommy doing? Oh, she's clearing out all Buster's old toys. The ones he doesn't use anymore. I wonder what's inside. Look, Buster's baby drum. He remembers that. Mommy is going to recycle it so someone else can enjoy it. Buster is sad. But he has a bigger, better drum kit now. But Buster wants to keep his little drum. He doesn't like to let go. Here's Scout with her tambourine. She's come round to play. Hooray! Time to make some music. Buster and Scout are ready to play. And here's Ash, too. He's come to listen. Now Buster and Scout have an audience. They're ready to rock. One, two, three, four. Nice. Buster and Scout are really grooving. Nice work, guys. Scout shakes the tambourine. Buster bangs the drum. Oh, he's trying to play his little drum at the same time. That doesn't work so well. He's trying to do too much at once. Oops. Aw, Ash wants to join in. But he doesn't have an instrument. And Buster has one too many. What's he going to do? Buster is giving his little drum to Ash to play. Now Ash can play along. And all three of them can have fun. Ready? One, two, three, four. There. That sounds even better than before. At the end of the day, Ash is going to give the drum back. But Buster knows he doesn't need two drums. He wants Ash to keep it. Ash is so happy. What a kind thing Buster did. Buster and Grandpa are going shopping at the supermarket. Here's the shopping list. Carrots, sweet corn, and a new soccer ball. Buster can't wait to get the new soccer ball. But Grandpa reminds him they need to get everything else on the list first. Starting with the carrots. Buster races off. There they are. Nice work, Buster. Next, sweet corn. He's found them. Whoops. Careful, Buster. All the tins might fall over. Phew. Great save, Grandpa. <laughs> Next. Yay! The soccer ball! Buster is zooming ahead to find the soccer ball. But wait! Grandpa's been left behind. He can't find him. Oh no! Buster and Grandpa can't see each other. Buster is searching and searching, but it's no good. Poor Buster is lost and getting worried. Look, it's Ash and his mommy. They can help him get back to Grandpa. At last, Buster is back safely with Grandpa. He knows he shouldn't have run so far ahead. He's sorry, but Grandpa forgives him. And here's the new soccer ball. Hooray! Buster is heading off to school. Wait a second, Buster. Don't forget, it's school photo day today. So you need an extra polish. <laughs> Bye, Mommy Bus. Look! Terry Tractor is here to take the school photos. Bandit and Ash are up first. Smile! Buster's turn next. And he wants to get an action shot. Whoops! Buster slipped! Watch out, Scout! Oh no, what's wrong? The teacher is handing Buster a mirror. Buster has knocked out his wobbly front tooth! Oh no! And now Buster is too embarrassed to have his photo taken. It's okay, Buster. You can have it taken another day. Buster is feeling really sad about missing out on the photos. But Mommy Bus is here to pick him up. And she's taking him to the dentist to get his tooth looked at. 
Hooray! <laughs> Buster is a little bit nervous. Don't worry, Buster. Amber the ambulance is here to take a look at that tooth for you. It's time to sit in the special dentist chair. Wow, that looks like so much fun! And now it's time to check that tooth. Don't worry, Buster. There's nothing to be scared of. First, Amber is looking at the tooth with a little mirror. Open wide, Buster. Say, ah! Uh. And what's that? Amber's going to play Buster a video. It's another bus, just like Buster. <laughs> and his tooth has fallen out. But don't worry, another one will grow in its place. He might be missing a tooth for now, but soon he'll have a brand new one. So there's nothing to be embarrassed about. Buster now feels much better. Thanks, Amber. <laughs> <laughs> and now he's going back to school to get his photo taken. <laughs> Gather in, Buster. Yeah. Say cheese. <laughs> Buster is having fun splashing in some very muddy puddles outside his house. Look, it's Grandpa Bus. Oops, now they're both covered in mud. But Grandpa has a plan. Where's he taking Buster? They're at the car wash to get cleaned up. Hooray! It looks like the car wash is all out of bubbles. Aha! There's the soap. Grandpa adds a small squirt. And Buster turns on the car wash. Go, Buster, go. Hang on. That's a lot of soap, Grandpa Bus. <laughs> Buster is covered in soapy bubbles. How funny. That was a very good joke, Grandpa. Now it's Grandpa's turn to get cleaned up. Looks like Buster's got a plan. He's getting his own back. Grandpa is covered in soap. He looks very silly. Look, Terry the tractor is here for a wash. Whoa, go easy, Buster. The bubbles are overflowing! Oh dear, what a soapy mess! Otis doesn't look very happy. Time to clear up the mess. What a silly day! Buster the bus and Scout the car are playing soccer. Buster shoots. Goal! Well done, Buster! Great work! Whoa! It's a soccer bus! He plays for the big bus soccer team. He wants Buster to come try out for the team. But oh no, Buster is too shy. Scout encourages him, and Buster says okay. He'll come to the big game tomorrow. Scout is very proud of her friend, but Buster is still nervous. That night, Buster is sleeping peacefully in his garage. Buster dreams he's playing on the big bus soccer team. The game starts, but oh dear, the buses play rough. Now it's Buster's turn in goal. He tries to save it, but oh dear, the soccer buses don't look very impressed. Poor Buster, he's tried so hard. Phew, it was just a bad dream. But now Buster's even more nervous about trying out for the team. Scout does her best to encourage him, 
Buster can do it. She believes in him. <laughs> now it's time for the big game. Robin blows his whistle and the game begins. Oh no, the red bus has been injured. They can't play anymore. Buster will have to step in. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster kicks the ball and the game goes on. Buster is going in goal now. The blue bus takes a shot and... Buster saved it! Well done, Buster! You did so well! Hooray! That was so much fun! Buster and his friends are back at school. They are telling each other what they got up to over the summer. Buster is so excited to tell everyone about his shark tooth. But first, Scout is telling everyone what she got up to over the summer. This summer, I went surfing for the first time ever. It was so cool. There was this one wave I saw that was absolutely massive. But I still got to surf it without falling off. And I went so fast. Scoot, scoot. Wow, Scout told such a cool story. Huh. What's wrong with Buster? Hmm. Oh, he thinks his shark tooth story won't be interesting enough after Scout's story. Hmm. Buster is going to tell everyone how he got the tooth. This summer, I went exploring in the deep, dark wood. It's full of animals and monsters, but I wasn't afraid one bit. But then, I came face to face with a dinosaur! But he had a oh. sore tooth. Uh, so I took it out for him to make him feel all better. Ah. Wait a second, that's not uh. right. Dinosaurs are extinct. Oh dear, Bandit thinks Buster isn't telling the truth. He couldn't really meet a dinosaur, could he? Oh. All right, it's not really a dinosaur tooth. Mm. It's a shark tooth. I thought that wouldn't be mm. interesting enough. But Buster, sharks are way cooler than dinosaurs. Go Buster, tell us the story. <laughs> this summer, I was at the beach, but then I saw, mm. no. Yes, oh. pirates are even cooler than sharks. <laughs> Yarm, <Yeah>, hearties. <laughs> hmm, okay, ah. the pirates and me, we found a shark, but he had a sore tooth. So we decided oh. to take the tooth hmm. out with a little help from a friendly little bee. <laughs> we took out the sore tooth and then they played catch with it. Gotcha! <laughs> and they played on the beach all day long. What a great story! It's so much fun to use your imagination. <laughs> Especially with friends. You're looking very cheerful today, Buster. What's that you've seen? Oh, wow! A kitten! It's adorable! Careful, Buster. You're really big, and the cat is really small. Oh, dear. I think you scared her, Buster. I wonder where she's going. You're too big to go under the fence, Buster. You'll have to go around. Where's that kitten gotten to? Hmm. Uh-oh! She's stuck up in that tall tree. You've got to rescue her, Buster. A trampoline? What a good idea! That'll be a nice soft landing for the kitten. Bounce? Oh no! The kitten bounced right the way back up into the tree. Let's try something else. A net? Good idea, Buster. Careful now. Gently. Gently. Oh, look, a bee. Stay still, Buster. I don't think he means any harm, but... Oh, dear. The net is broken, too. Back to the drawing board. Hold on. I think Buster has another idea. 
Of course! Buster's brought Ashley the fire truck. She'll be able to reach the kitten with her tall ladder. There we go. <laughs> the kitten will be safe now. Oh no, I think the kitten is too scared to come down the ladder. I wonder what Buster has planned. Oh yes, the kitten's ball of wool. She'll come down to play with that. Look how happy the kitten is. Here she comes down the ladder. There, safe and sound. Nice work, Buster. Oh, wow! Buster's become a rocket, and he's going to space! Five, four, three, two, one! Blast off! Look at Buster go! All right! You did it, Buster! You're in outer space! What a cool place to be! I think Buster wants to go space exploring! Look at that! It's a red planet! Let's go in for a closer look! Hey there, little space buddy! I bet that alien has never seen a bus before! Where are you off to now, Buster? Oh, a yellow planet! It's so beautiful with that huge ring around it! Look at that! Buster's gonna go for a drive around the ring! Let's see how fast you can go! Whoa! That was fun! What's Buster seen now? It's a purple planet! Isn't it huge? Whoa! Round and round the planets Buster goes! Round the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet. But wait! Oh no! A blue planet! Buster's going too fast! I think he's going to hit it! Oh, thank goodness! It was only a dream! You're okay, Buster! Look! Scout is using her telescope to look at the night sky! Take a look, Buster! There's the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet! Hello, little space buddy! <laughs> hey there, Buster! What's that poster there? Hmm, a fire truck? Sure looks exciting, doesn't it? Look! It's Ashley the fire truck! <laughs> I think Buster wants to join the fire brigade. Uh. <laughs> Go on, Buster. Time to get ready for your first day on the job. Just a few little changes and... <laughs> wow! Look at that! Buster really is a fire truck. He's got a ladder, a siren, and a water hose. <laughs> Uh-oh, the fire alarm. There's a fire somewhere. Ashley has to go and take care of it. You stay here, Buster. Hey, it's Tony the truck. Watch out for that puddle. Oh no! That falling box started a fire at the fire station. What are we going to do? Quick, Buster the fire truck, put that fire out! Uh-oh, the fire has spread to the roof. Keep blasting water, Buster. Hooray, Robin is here to help. And Ashley's back too. <gasps> you can do it if you work together. Two fire trucks are better than one. Phew, the fire is out at last. Nice work, Buster and Ashley. <laughs> Look, it's that poster again. Now it's Buster on the poster. Whoa, you really are a hero, Buster. Hey, Buster. <laughs> Looks like another day to have fun. Oh no, it's Bandit the bus. Buster, watch out, you will crash. Wait, what's happening? Oh, wow! You're floating in the air! Oh. <laughs> this is incredible, Buster! Hmm? <laughs> I wonder if you can fly! 
Oh, wow! You've turned into a superhero! You are so fast! Super Buster is here! Woohoo! What has Buster seen? It's Otis the police car. I wonder what Otis is looking for inside the tunnel. Wait, it's Bandit the bus. What is he up to? This doesn't look good. Oh no! He's pushed the boulder over the edge and trapped Otis in the tunnel. You've got to save him, Buster. You can't let Bandit the bus get away with this. That boulder looks very heavy. It's okay, Buster. You're a superhero now. You can save him. Oh, Buster, your eyes. Wow, you have laser vision. Well done, Buster. You've set Otis free. Now let's catch that naughty bandit bus. There's Bandit. Looks like he's up to no good again. Scout, watch out. Poor Scout. Look who it is. You're in trouble now. Super Buster is here. Buster, you can stop him. <laughs> Super Buster is too strong for Bandit. That should stop him. Phew. Now Buster just needs to help Scout out of the <laughs> pond. <laughs> Look at Bandit. He's stuck now. Oh, it was all just a daydream. I don't think the teacher is very happy. <laughs> I wonder what Buster and Digger are doing. <laughs> wow, who painted that? Looks like you guys want some ice cream. <gasps> Digger, <laughs> that is one big ice cream cone. Oh look, here comes Iggy, the ice cream truck. Buster and Digger want Iggy to help make them the giant ice cream. Now let's see. Oh. Cherries. Mmm, that's a delicious flavor. Let's pick that. Wow, look at all that ice cream. Right, next we need a blue ice cream. Blueberries? Perfect. That is looking so good, Buster. Okay, yellow next. Bananas, good choice. <laughs> you want more? Okay, this has to be the last flavor, otherwise it will be too big. Apple it is. This is going to be one tasty ice cream. <laughs> one last effort, Iggy. That ice cream looks quite wobbly. Steady as you go, Digger. Robin has come to get Scout so that she can find out what Buster and Digger have made for her birthday. You better follow Robin, Scout. Whoa. Happy birthday, Scout! <laughs> that is the biggest ice cream I have ever seen! Oh no, Digger! Watch out, Scout! That was close. <laughs> Blow the candle out, Scout. Now you can all tuck into the ice cream. <laughs> yum, yum. <laughs>